Hello everyone and welcome to a come with me at the Disney store. I am on a very busy Oxford Street in the middle of the day but I wanted to go in and show you what's new in store. There are no other stores in England so I wanted to see what they have in because although we've got the Shop Disney website I love to come and see things in person and let you know what I think is good, how much things are and just show you what's new and any of you that can't come up to London and see I thought we'd have a little look so if you enjoy this and you like Disney vlogs and Disney kind of videos then please click consider subscribing I make Disney vlogs travel home and lifestyle stuff so I've just come back from Disneyland Paris and Walt Disney World so if you want to check out those vlogs then click the link below but anyway we're gonna go and see what's new in the Disney store so on the outside right now they are are trying to sort of push some of their okay, theatre shows. So we've got Beauty and the Beast, The Lion King, Frozen, and Mary Poppins, I think, is actually leaving. So yeah, they're the ones that they have. I actually saw Frozen the Musical again for the second time last night, and it's amazing. So let's go on inside because, yeah, it's always very busy in here. But we'll start on the left and work our way around. So this is what it looks like as you come in. So on the left, we've got a stitch collection. This is nice. I like this, like a bean bag thing, 55 pound. And actually this whole range is really nice. I think Lilo and Stitch merch is actually pretty popular, but I quite like this. It's kind of subtle beachy vibes. Like look at this. This is a really nice little cool bag. It's very like subtle Disney, you know? I like stuff like this. It's not screaming in your face, but you know it's Disney. Um, and it's quite a big one actually, this if you're going on a picnic. So this is £22 and actually that's the first time I've seen the prices so big labelled up like that. I don't know if they're all like that, but normally the labels are like quite small. Oh, look, they've definitely changed them. £18 for this, what is this, a pen pot? High tides and good vibes. Oh, that's fun. What's this? Is it a paperweight? £18. Oh wow, it's, it's quite heavy. Is it a bottle opener? It might be a bottle open actually, is it? No. I'm not quite sure what that is actually. It doesn't even say. So the stitch range sort of carries on around here. So they obviously have plush as well. And it's all like summery things. So we've got some little cocktail stick things. We've got a plant pot. Ice mold tray. Oh, that's fun. Quite like that actually. That is how much? Oh, that doesn't have a price on it. Don't know how much that is. Um, oh, that's nice. I don't know what that's for, but I guess you could use it for anything. Hang on, let's have a look at another one just in case. Let's see. Oh, it's £35. It's got a nice little leather handle. That would be really good in like a, a bedroom actually for like pens and or like organising your gadgets. If you had like leads and whatnot. I don't know. Cute though. What's this down here? Already I don't remember seeing this on Shop Disney. Probably is on there, I've just not noticed it. It's like a chopping board with little leather handles on the side. It's actually quite sturdy and nice, 35 pound. That's really lovely actually. <laughs> on the other side, on the opposite side, they have this blue and white range, which they've had for quite a while actually. This is not new, but although actually, hang on, she says, I don't recall seeing that mug. It very much reminds me of like Greece, like Santorini, you know? <laughs> I don't know if that is any of the inspiration, but it's really nice, very summery. I like the colours. It would look really nice in an outside garden space. Like, look at this nice little fake plant. Subtle Mickey, £22. And then this is a napkin holder set. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? £12. Okay, next we've got the pet stuff. And we actually already own this bowl for Bonnie. It is £13, but I've not seen this Disney Dogs mug, and oh my gosh, I love that. I don't love the material of it, though. It's actually the same as the bowl, but do you know what I mean when I say that? I don't know if that makes sense. It's like a mat, but I really do like that, Disney Dogs. <laughs> That's really cute, and it is £16. I love that they have pet stuff now, as we have a dog ourselves, so we've got another little bowl. Oh, there's a kid walking right in front of me. <laughs> this is a um, portable pet bowl that you can push out. Um, just a bit unnecessary though with the Mickey ears. We have loads of these at home, but I guess it's quite cute if you don't already have one. Is this a pet toy then down here? If it's with the pet stuff, that's absolutely massive. I wish you could appreciate the size of that. that my little Bonnie would not fit that in her mouth. <laughs> okay, they've got this Winnie the Pooh collection. So there's loads of bits in here. I absolutely love that mug. 
It's got like its own little lid. Disney, how much is this? This is so cute. This is really nice. I like all this floral stuff. I think these are new mugs. I haven't seen these before, but they're absolutely massive. But I love the classic look to them. Like that's really nice. If this was a little bit smaller, I would have that. And they've got a um, Pinocchio one as well. Very, very cute. Other than that, what else have we got? Oh, that looks new as well. Is that it's a Cinderella one, my happy place. Uh, we've got Mrs. Potts down there. Oh, they have the um, 50th anniversary ones. Oh, hang on. Disneyland Paris 30th. Oh my God, I didn't even see that in Disney, you know. How wild, 10 pound. Oh my God, I quite like that. We've also got this tink one, but that's actually a weird size. That is Disneyland Paris though, 30th anniversary. And this one is Walt Disney World 50th. Don't know if you can see inside the mug there. This one's 18 pound, this little tink one. This would be good for a coffee actually. Um, that's 18 pound as well. Oh, they have some more of these like massive classic mugs, but they have Sword in the Stone. Like, when do you ever see Sword in the Stone? That's really nice. I like these, I just wish they weren't so big. And they have grape soda as well. Oh, it's like, why is it so, oh, hang on, let's try a different one. Cute, another 18 pounds. They don't quite fit in that shelf, actually. <laughs> they have some more pet stuff on the other side. So if you have a cat, they have a little cat collar. Oh my gosh, look at this. <laughs> did they do that or did a kid do that? I can't quite decide. Um, anyway, so yes. They have a very nice little dog apron. I do love this print actually with all the Disney dogs on it. It's really nice. All right, we've got the Pride collection now, which is absolutely wonderful. I love this shirt. This would look so good on Gary or Adam, if you're watching. I feel like that's so nice with the subtle like Mickey rainbow 45 pound. Um, and they have these very nice ears that I haven't seen before, like rainbow ears, denim. They are how much? don't know. This is really difficult to give you prices because that really doesn't say. I'm assuming they're about £24 though because that's how much a lot of the ears are. Um, and then they also have this which is a Walt Disney World rock sack which I quite like this you know. The Pride range. It's really nice. Pop that back on there. They've got a plush mini celebrating Pride. Um, can't see, oh no I was going to say I can't see Mickey. No Mickey's down there and they are 23 pounds just spotted this pin pixar animation 16 pound i feel like my friend gary would like that it's quite big now the till is on the left and we're gonna pan around um but if i spin to my left you'll see these glass cabinets and they have Walt Disney World stuff. So this is a pair of ears that are 600 pounds, which is just absolutely wild. So yeah, I can't see myself buying those anytime soon, but I do really like the castle. Look at that, 200 pounds. Beautiful model of it. Um, and Mickey down there is also 200 pound and he's actually massive. That's for the Disneyland Paris 30th, so that's quite interesting. And Minnie is on a little horse down there, 60 pounds. Which is nice. We've got some more homeware bits that say love and the O is like Mickey. Um, yeah, a couple of nice things. This is the kind of stuff I like to have in my home. Subtle Disney stuff, although look at that reef. It's very hard to film for you when I'm probably gonna get copyrighted for the music, but um, I'm gonna do it nonetheless. So let's keep going round. I think it's a lot of plush over here actually. So I'm probably not gonna show you all of the plush because they all are what you'd expect. Although I haven't seen these ones before. This is very cute. Look at Pluto. This is like a different version plush of um, Mickey and Minnie. They're 30 pound each. They're quite big actually. Oh, it's heavy. Oh my gosh, it's like a doorstop. Okay. <laughs> Hakuna Matata is very loud behind me, so um, forgive me, but they have um, some London specific Mickey and Minnie's Sprouted Hill. And then like I said, all the plush over that side. And then they also have the coach range, like a couple of the coach bits here. I absolutely love all of this. I pick it up every time I see it. Like this is just amazing. 500 pounds though. So let's put that back quickly. I do love this bum bag though. Look at that. Oh my gosh. This is great if you can't make it to um, Walt Disney World. You can still get your hands on it, but it's 275 pounds for the purse. Here is the current selection of 50th anniversary stuff. 
Um, it's a little bit bleak, I'm afraid. It's not all that exciting. Not seen this before. It's got a little castle on the top there. That is 18 pounds. Why is the music so loud? We were getting ready and there wasn't a cloud in the sky. Um, guys, snack is, oh my God, how fun are they? 28 pounds and they have a matching spirit jersey, Disneyland one, and a matching bag. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. Why do I like these? The lounge fly ones, that's why. Fun. So they only have this spirit jersey in a medium and it is 55 pound, which is actually a good price. I know that they go up to like 70, so yeah, that's really nice, I like that. They also have this sort of hot pink color. Again, just looks like a lot of mediums. And this is a Disneyland one too. And then they've got some random, oh, that's cute. Just seems to be a lot of mediums, but this is so cute, this popcorn one. Oh my gosh, I love that. And this pink one, might as well show you this. Again, Disneyland. I haven't seen this before. Daisy Duck little shopper bag, like a beach bag. That's 35 pounds. It's quite pricey to be honest for what that is, I'm not gonna lie. They have some lounge flies and this one's quite nice. It's a bit different and it's sort of a cross body thing. Wow, that's really cool. Looks like a packaging for an action figure. Not seen that before, 70 pounds. They also have this one and the popcorn one um, and Lilo and Stitch. There's not a lot of lounge flies in this week actually. I still really like this. I've seen this last time I was in here. 45 pound with the Dapper Dans. It's quite cute, isn't it? I quite like that. They've got lots of ears. They've got these new light year ones that are quite cute. They're not my taste, but um, they are quite cute. And then, oh, they're new. I've not seen those before. Oh, what's up with the bow? I'm not gonna lie, I'm not sure about these. Like that bow is looking very sad, so that's a no from me. I don't remember seeing these. They're pretty. Sparkly ones. Oh, we've got High School Musical playing now. Again, I haven't seen those before either. They're like Mulan inspired. And, oh, these are sparkly ones. There's quite a few new ones actually. Look at these. Like them, 24 pound. Yeah, they're cute, it's cute. I don't need any more ears though, guys. I need to walk away. <laughs> oh, a few more lounge flies, pride ones, and like a satchel down there. And then on the left here, we have some pajamas that are in the sale, like wintry ones long sleeved they have a new mickey main attraction um collection and yeah this is obviously tiki room so this is very cute i just don't collect this stuff the pins are absolutely ginormous like yeah it's really big but the collection's very cute and actually that mickey is nice if you're collecting these this is a nice one like that looping back round to the front so we've done a full circle We've got loads of Lightyear toys at the front here. So yeah, Lightyear and a little bit of Toy Story too. So you can get Buzz and all the gang. They haven't got anything going on on their castle display right now, but um, I always love going downstairs. It's definitely more um, kids' toys and clothing, but you never know, we might find a hidden gem. Also, the music's not as loud down here, so I can actually talk to you. Um, but this is what it looks like down here. Should we see if there's any mugs we haven't found yet? See, some of it's repeated. Um, oh my gosh, they have Christmas. I love the Christmas stuff. Uh, oh, that actually, we haven't seen that. Is that the Winnie the Pooh um, kitchen roll holder? <laughs> That's quite cute with a little bumblebee on the top. Um, oh my gosh, why do I like that? <laughs> Oh, that's so cute. Okay, Christmas decorations, real talk now. They do actually have quite a few different options in. Um, so they've got Lightyear, Buzz, which is quite cute. I already bought the Mickey and Minnie wedding engagement ones. Um, what is in here? Oh, that's cute. Mickey in there, little ball ball. They've got a 50th Walt Disney World one. That's lovely. So then you don't have to go all the way to Disney or you don't have to try and bring it home. Got Nemo, Baymax, that's really cute. I think we already have a Baymax one actually. He's covered in um, these lights, so don't need Baymax. Um, but I've just found some more of these and they are two pound. And if this doesn't give you a hint as to what time of year we're thinking of going to Walt Disney World, then I don't know what it does. Oh my gosh, this Peter Pan decoration. Hang on, 
look at the detailing in that that's so nice how much is that 22 pound no surprise because it is beautiful i do like the sketchbook rangers actually the winnie the pooh one there as well is so nice look at him look at himself in the mirror with his t-shirt that's so sweet on a little book we've got turning red she's on either side which is very cute like the attention to detail that's 20 pound and that one's really nice as well look at jasmine lovely why do i want mini as a nutcracker oh my gosh that's so cute but also kind of weird like i don't know how i feel about that now actually oh is it in the sale was 55 pound i wonder how much it is because the little sale label is peeled off a bit kind of like her <laughs> there's another one there why do I love Christmas Disney stuff so much? I don't know. I need to calm down. All right, we've got some notebooks. So they've got this castle collection book that's actually half price. And they have a Lion King one. Uh, Winnie the Pooh up there. These ones are a bit bigger. Are they just notebooks? Yeah, they're just notebooks. Oh, that Peter Pan one's nice. Oh, that one's in the sale as well. £7.80. What's that in there? Oh, that's cute. It's like a little writing set. Not seen that before cute they have 50th stuff like dotted all around this is a sketchbook how much is that doesn't say oops i'm gonna drop it oh no oh no panic panic oh these are actually quite cute notebooks i like these two for 15 pound and i absolutely love moana she is one of my favorites one of my favorite films i just don't need another notebook right now though guys but if i did i would have that this is a lot of toys over this side now which doesn't um, interest me as much, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I don't remember them having all these mirrors, by the way. Did they add these recently? But they've got Funko Pops. They've got some in the sale. Oh, they actually have Minnie Mouse one here on the People Mover. That's cute, that's a Walt Disney World 50 one. 16.99. I've just noticed some really cute Funkos. Look at this one, a special edition. And it's the Pirates of the Caribbean dog. Why do I love it? I literally love it. It's got a mark on the box though, but it's special edition, 1999. Can't see any more actually, are there more? Oh yeah, there are some more over there. So if I didn't want one with a mark, I could get that. But also look at Rapunzel. How cute does she look with a little paintbrush? 12.99. Oh, they are here. Look, that's easier to see. <laughs> All in the case. They've got some Hamilton ones too. 2021 full convention, limited edition, Lafayette. 22.99 so they do vary in price a little bit although george washington is five pound fifty oh okay we actually went and saw hamilton in the west end it was amazing i loved it oh my gosh how fun it's a small world game in the sale for 14 pound 49 was 30 quid and it's like a little game sell your boat collect your cards spot children and animals in the 3d board to score match the most pictures before sunset to win i don't know what age this is designed for does it say oh a game for four players oh age four plus two to six players why do i quite like that <laughs> why do i want to play this with benj they've also got a villains is this a game as well oh yeah look this is a villains game that is two or three players aged 10 and up, 40 to 60 minutes. Wow, that's quite long actually. Um, I don't really love Disney villains, but they're quite scary, aren't they? So I'm not sure how I feel about that. Okay, they have a lot of children's clothing and bits around here. And they have some huge sort of like play sets too. This used to be an area where they had coloring and stuff for children, but it doesn't look like they're doing it right now. Um, but they do have sale items and you know how I feel about sale stuff. Um, so, what is this? Nice little outdoor blanket or indoor blanket. Little Mickey, £60 down to 30 Oh no, am I not going to be able to put that back now? Oh gosh. So many cute little dresses. Look at that. And there's a little matching hairband and shoes. Honestly, if I had a little girl, they like she would just live in all this. In fact, I like that for myself. <laughs> a couple more sale bits hidden around the corner. Um, what's this t-shirt? I'm not your everyday princess. That kind of looks like a pajama top. Does it have bottoms? No. Listen to your heart. That's quite nice. It's very um, soft, actually. <laughs> Hang on, let me have a look at that. It's quite a cute t-shirt. Cute. I just wish everything wasn't cropped. We've got just a spoonful of sugar, 
little tea towel in the sale as well. This is nine pound, but I actually really like this one. I'm not sure it goes with our kitchen, but uh, yeah, it's obviously Cinderella. Make the fire, fix the breakfast, wash the dishes, do the mopping, and the sweeping and the dusting. £11.20. <laughs> That's a really cute tea towel. I quite like that. Oh, they have a matching um, apron as well to that tea towel. And then they have tiki room ones as well. My main girl, Moana, just chilling here. Love her. Um, and then again, lots more just dressing up stuff. Oh my gosh, Moana dressing up. I haven't seen these before, but these are really cute little boxes with pins in it. Hang on, let me show you. Like this, this is for Lady and the Tramp. Very sweet. Um, and then they've got bigger ones. So that says plush included. Oh, I can't open that. Maybe it just comes with a plush then as well, I don't know. This is not an exciting haul, but this is the only thing I'm buying at two pound was 12. So there we go, that is everything that I found in the Disney store on Oxford Street in London. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. Let me know the things that you liked the most. And uh, if you enjoyed this, I can do some more in the future and show you around. But it was very loud and noisy in there, very busy. Um, I still love browsing nonetheless. Only bought that one thing, the Christmas accessories. And now I'm gonna take myself for some dinner. So have a great rest of the day. Thanks for watching, see you soon. Bye. <laughs>